All right, here we go. A new game. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to a new video here on the channel. So today I'm doing something completely different, and I'm playing a new video game, like a completely new game. Uh, instead of Minecraft, I'm going to be playing some Stardew Valley. Uh, obviously, this is still a Minecraft channel. I just thought I'd throw in some episodes of me playing this. I have literally never played this before. I discovered it through GB ASMR like maybe a year ago. She uploaded a video of her doing a Stardew Valley Let's Play and she was doing ASMR at the same time. I don't know. And the game just looks super cool to me and I just bought it because I don't know I'm getting a bunch of videos in my recommended about the game and it just looks cool and I love to start playing it so here we go this is this is crazy for me I'm really excited so let's click new and okay so now we just create our profile I guess so I'll put my name as Ariana my farm name bro that's a tough one vibing farm no that just doesn't sound right doesn't it chill farm just sounds too basic like not good at all what about chill times farm Honestly, I think that's what I'm just going to go for because I can't come up with anything better at the moment. Favorite thing? That just sounds weird. We'll put an axe because <laughs> why not? I don't know. No, obviously I'm a female, so we're going to go with the female thing. Animal preference. There's like different cats. Ooh, dog. Ooh, what? Ooh, there are different types of dogs. We'll go with this little one right here. He looks really cute. I like the big ears. Or maybe this one. Now nah, we'll go with this one. He looks cute. So skin, this is just changing skin tone. So we're going to go with a, a pale one, but obviously not too pale. Oh, this one looks good. Okay. Hair, um, we could put it in a bun because why not? I never put my hair in a bun though. Usually only when I'm working out, that's it. Now my shirt. There's so many different designs, but I like the overalls. Oh, or I like these with a blue and a white shirt. Pants, we're just going to go with normal jeans. Eye color. My eyes are kind of hazel, so we'll go like right there. Well, these are more green than anything, but I'll just make them a little darker. Now, the hair color, honestly, it looks good already, but I think we'll make it a little bit darker. And there we go. Now I think it's going to take us through an intro. Ooh. Okay, what is this? And for my very special granddaughter, I want you to have this sealed envelope. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. <laughs> There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life and your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. I already know where this is going. This is really nice. Now let grandpa rest. Oh, we're working at a weird company. Oh, someone got fired. That's just depressing. <laughs> oh, Joja. That's a very weird company name, but okay. Oh my God, that guy's taking drugs. This is not very child friendly. Oh, here I am. Am I crying? Aw, bro, I'm sitting at my desk crying. It's only one o'clock. Oh, my envelope. Uh-oh. Dear Ariana, if you're reading this, you must be in a dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy. Chill times far. <laughs> oh my god, I'm starting to regret the name of it now. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's a perfect place to start your new life. This is my most precious gift of all, and it's now yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my dear. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. Aw. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Okay, dope. I'll say hi to Lewis if he's still alive. Hopefully he's alive. <laughs> okay, now we're in a bus. We're going to Stardew Valley. It looks really pretty out here. Like, I'm down to see this this valley in real life. <laughs> Imagine Stardew Valley in real life. That sounds peaceful. Oh, hello. You must be Ariana. Why, yes, I am, Robin. Hello. You're Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here if you'll follow me. Oh, look at the pretty little house. What the heck? Everything looks so cute. This is Chill Time's farm. Oh, I'm gonna laugh every time I see that name, aren't I? Oh, God. Am I crying tears of joy now, or am I just crying? <laughs> What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. Oh, I'm, I'm surprised. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Oh, hello. Is this Lewis? Yeah, it's Lewis. Ah, the new farmer. Welcome. I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. That's cool. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. So you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. Well, we love that vibe. We stand an aesthetic queen. So 
Rustic, that's one way to put it. <laughs> Crusty might be a little more apt, though. Oh, don't listen to her, Ariana. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. <laughs> anyway, you must be tired from the long journey, so you should get some rest. Tomorrow, you had to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Okay, so it's not just living on a farm. It's like a whole town of people. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. Well, good luck. Here you go. Here's our first day. My progress has been saved. Oh, look at this. Okay, so I move a WAC. I'm, I'm, I'm good with that. Oh, whoa. Oh, there's a, there's a box? What do I do? I right-click. Okay. Parsnip seeds. You receive 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Mayor Lewis. Oh, that's dope. The mayor. Well, I mean, it's a small town, so. It's Monday the 1st at 6.40 in the morning. Yeah, like I would ever get up this early. Uh, that's a lie. So here's my hot bar. It's kind of like the Minecraft hot bar. Haha. <laughs> So I got my axe, these parsnip seeds. Oh, look at the TV. Select channel, weather report, fortune teller, or living off the land. Let's click living off the land. That sounds interesting. Welcome. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. This one's for all you greenhorns out there. Chop wood and search for wild forge to earn some cash while waiting for your first harvest. So let's just leave the house. And I have an axe. Oh, well, I'll need a pickaxe for that. Oh, this is so cute. The sounds are like super satisfying too for some reason. Like just chopping the bushes. Okay, now I need my pickaxe. Oh my god, chopping the wood is like the most satisfying noise ever. What is this that I'm holding? Okay, that's that's a hoe. It looks different than in Minecraft. <laughs> but I'll use that to chop up the leaves. So I have to use a cursor to di to direct my my swings toward the towards the plants. Let's let's collect the rocks and then we'll go through and collect the bushes. Or actually, let's get this this big tree right here. Am I cutting it down right? No, I don't think I am. <laughs> okay, let's come right here and then maybe we can chop it down like that. Oh, there we go. Our first big tree, y'all. Oh my god, that's exciting. Oh, my inventory is full. Okay, so Lewis did say something about putting stuff in a chest. So maybe I'll go right here. Okay, how do I put my stuff in? And what is this thing? Clay. Oh, interesting. I'll put the clay in the chest too. Okay, so we just got to do a bunch of cleaning up for this first episode. This is extremely nice though. Like, this is just going to be very satisfying and chill to record. And the reason I'm recording this, like, I play other games and I just never record them because I, I really only had good experiences recording Minecraft. Whenever I record other games, I just didn't really enjoy it as much as I did when I record Minecraft. But I thought, you know, this is my first time ever playing this game. Might be fun to try recording it and uploading it to the channel. Just to see what it's like and if I want to upload more videos playing this game. But so far, it seems really nice. Like, just the way the game looks, the way the mechanics are, everything just seems really nice. I think what kind of, like, motivated me to buy the game is uh, a few days ago, I saw the owner, or the creator, rather, of the game talk about it in an interview with this news organization. And, okay, I just got something that said, you feel exhausted from overworking. So, dang, you actually have, like, health in this, or energy. Oh, yeah, my energy bar is really low. I guess I should sleep, but first of all, I'm just going to put myself in the chest really quick, and then I'll go sleep. We have a bunch of sap, stone, fiber. Seems really cool. And then we got wood and leaves and trees and everything. So, seems cool. But let's go back inside. And I guess I just gotta sleep, or maybe I have to eat. Go to sleep for the night? It's literally only 12.40 p.m., but I don't know how to get my energy up. Day one of spring, year one. Okay. So, this is looking nice. This is looking nice. I don't know what this, this G means. Does that mean gold? <laughs> well, I don't know what it means. Okay. Now we're on to day two. All right, let's go ahead. Let's wake up at 6 a.m. Let's turn on the news, because why not? Let's look at the, the fortune teller. Welcome to Welwick's Oracle, the only show where the voice of the spirits is channeled directly to you. The spirits feel neutral today. The day is in your hands. Oh, that's nice. So, I don't know how I'm going to eat, but I do have parsnip seeds. So, maybe I can go outside and plant them and then make some food, I guess. Oh, but we have mail. Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Where Piers got you covered. Stop by Piers General Store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. Oh, I should probably go to the town. Lewis wanted me to go to the town, but do we have more mail? Oh, here we go. Hello there. Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got some for you. All right, so let's go to town. And okay, I can't tell where I am, but what's over here? Okay, nothing really seems to be over here. Or actually, there's a house. I don't want to go to anybody's house, though. I want to go to town. Or maybe that is town and I'm just stupid. I don't know. Let's go check it out. Oh, here you go. Yeah, so there's like a little hospital or something. What is this? Oh, a calendar. That's nice. Everybody's birthday is in spring. Moose's birthday is coming up, though. And there's an egg festival and a flower dance. That's nice. Okay, but the rest of the town... 
Okay, so this is Piers. Can I go inside? It's locked. It opens at 9 a.m. Okay, and it's only 7 a.m. Jeez, I'm up early. What's in here, though? Again, locked. Is everything opening at 9 a.m.? I mean, there's a giant plus sign, so I'm assuming it's a hospital. But if the hospital doesn't open till 9 a.m., that's kind of weird. The Star Drop Saloon. Again, probably won't open till the evening, though. Oh, opens at 12 p.m. to 12 a.m. So there's a lot around here. There's also a bunch of houses, too. I feel like I should explore some of those. Let's check out this one. What is this? It's locked. It opens 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. Oh, so these are actual... Oh, I thought these were houses, but they're actual town buildings. Okay. Oh, who is this? What? What do you want? Go away. Oh, okay, Shane. Jeez, man. Oh, let's check out my journal. Oh, so these are like assignments that I give myself. To the beach. Someone named Willie invited you to visit the beach south of town. He says he has something to give you. Oh, okay, so I gotta go there before 5 p.m. So south of town, I'm just gonna keep walking south. <laughs> Here we go. A nice little bridge. Oh, here. This is nice. We got an ocean, two seagulls. Ahoy there, miss. Uh, ahoy. Uh, <laughs> heard there's a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Okay, cool. Can I have a fishing rod or something? <laughs> uh, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. That sounds rough. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Awesome! Okay, so I knew you would give me a fishing rod. Like, why, why else would I come down to the ocean? You received a bamboo pole. Okay. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now. So come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. So let's try and catch some fish. All right. So I got my fishing... Oh, you know what? Boo! Oh, wow, that was really bad. <laughs> that was really bad. I don't know how to pick up fish. Hopefully one comes soon, though, because I am very impatient sometimes. An exclamation point kind of popped over my head, and I got excited, but I don't know if I did it right. I'm starting to feel exhausted. Oh, God. I feel like I need to eat something. For sure you have to eat in this game. I run out of energy, so I have to, like, sleep, but it's only 1.50 p.m., so that kind of confuses me. Maybe I should plant these seeds... Oh, oh, I got something. Click to raise bar. What? Oh, keep bar behind fish. Oh, I got it. I got a herring, an eight inch herring. Wow, interesting. All right, well, I caught one fish. <laughs> Let's try and sell it to Willie. Willie, Willie, I caught a fish. I caught a fish. I caught a fishy. Eat herring? Yes, please. I need food. Ew, did I just eat a raw herring? I don't know, whatever. I got 18 energy. Um, okay, so for sure, you do eat. Um, maybe I can buy something. Do I have money? I don't know. I want to buy something. Oh, here we go. Okay. So I'm assuming this 693 stuff is my gold. Trout soup gives me 100 energy. Do I really want to buy trout? Okay, I bought it. Oh, God. Okay. That's nice. Eat trout soup? Yes. Oh, yummy. Okay. Well, now I'm pretty, I don't know, energetic at the moment. But uh, I think I should go back. The fishing was fun. But I feel as if it's time for me to go back to shore. But wait a second. Look at the beach. Or the, the beach. No, the be beach. Oh, look. There's someone over here. I want to chat. Ah, the new farmer we've all been expecting and whose arrival has sparked many conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Oh, I got a clam, though. That's kind of cool. Can you eat the clam? No, you can't. Okay. <laughs> Why did I think you could eat clams for a second? I'm, I think I'm thinking of oysters. Uh, what is this? Hmm. With 300 pieces of wood, this could be fixed. Oh, interesting. Well, I don't think I have 300 pieces of wood right now, so I'll probably just go away for a sec. Oh, more people! What the heck? This is exciting. Oh, a stranger. My name's Vincent. Mom says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. <laughs> Hello, person. Person. I can't talk to the person. Oh, hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. Hello, Sam. Who else is around here? Is this a house up here? I think I see a little house. Interesting. Oh, you can actually go inside. What is this? Good evening. So how was your first night in the old cottage? Oh, it's Lewis. Pretty good, I guess. Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down he actually loved that house. Now this is cool. This is just Lewis's house. Should I be in here? Should I eat some food? You got food for me? All right. I'm just going to leave Lewis's house. He has a cool old car, though. But I've been recording for like 30 minutes, so I think I'm going to end off today's episode because <laughs> it's really long, and I think I'm going to take it slow with this series. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed, and um, yeah, I can't believe I'm playing a new game, but this looks exciting, and this game looks really fun, so can't wait to 
play it and record it and share it with you guys. And I'm gonna go eat my spaghetti squash at what is now exactly 11 p.m. And um, yes, I'll see you guys later, bye.